It's a dream being brought to reality, says Natural Gilbert, the brainchild behind this evening of Africa. It started, she says, back in 2009 when she left Antigua to visit and later lived in two African countries for three years of her life. Natural thought she had an obligation to come back to Grenada and share the knowledge acquired on the missing link of our African heritage. With the support of Ms. Carol Vasquez, who has transitioned just weeks shy of this event, will be rolled out also in her honor. Look at that. So I made it. And when I came to Grenada, I was coming from South Africa. That's when I arrived. So um, it's time. It's time and it's a community event. It's not just natural. If you see the flyer, the flyer says no Kukai tribe, that's me, and Gart, which was Carol Vasquez. And she planned with us up into the last three Wednesdays and she transitioned. So we will honor her. We were already going to pay libations, hold libations. We must honor our ancestors. We talked about that, not knowing that she would be one. So that's a whole nother story. So we look forward to honoring her. Everyone, we would invite everyone to call out a name. It could be your late great grandmother. It could be the late great Nelson Mandela. Just honor an ancestor. With permission granted by the Ministry of Health to accommodate at least 50 persons, Natural extends the invitation. Another thing that we would love is anybody who's been to Africa. Now I've met quite a few people on island that have African experiences. Please come. If you have any African experience, whether you're elder or whether you're younger and you made it like myself, please come. We need you, we need your energy. Find out the truth and the richness of Africa so we can possibly get back to who we truly are. I don't want our children to wake up one morning and say, uh, African what? African who? I'm not African because we're almost there. Dress as you wish. Persons are reminded to observe the COVID-19 protocols of wearing their mask, sanitizing on entry, and social distancing. I won't say required, but I will say please embrace. Embrace our culture, whatever that is for you. If that's simply bare feet, and that's all you got, bring it. If it's wrapping your head, bring it. If it's your beautiful African, Lele, bring it. Yes, please, we want to. And we got a little surprise too, I'm not gonna tell the people. So if I was you, I'd come and embrace my culture like never before, that's what I would do. Christina John, GBN News.